to be born into sun is to be born under a black star. Lac Cell V. Might be worth looking nice into. Nice tune. Best cure for the beast, a witcher. an escort. That's something I do often, but might be worth investigating. What's this about? Oh, Lapiota, give me strength. I can't bear this, please! I believe I've been clear. No presentation today. Oh, wait! Are you not that famous witcher, Geralt of Rivia? I believe I have work for you. Saw your notice. Mentioned a monument? The matter is a delicate one, but mind you, I pay well. Unless I can say no more at this stage. Interested? A statue. Just tell me, what's the problem? A picture's worth a thousand words. More, I dare say. Come with me. I'll show you. Here it is! Our pride and joy, Reginald Daubry. A giant among lovers. A poking, puncturing swordsman, and atop all that, an unrifled titler of harps and other organs. Mm -hmm. So what's wrong with it? How should I put this? It's lost its jewels. Somebody stole the testicles off a statue. No ordinary statue, mind you. The sole monument made using a cast of the great Reginald's own genitals, certified and authenticated. Sprung directly from his loins, they grant all who stroke them unparalleled virility. All who buy a ticket, that is. Thus, you must retrieve those stones. Got my attention. Now tell me about this Reginald, all you know. There's so much to tell. Legend has it he and the architect Faramont planned and laid out Beauclair. Hmm. Impressed already. In particular, Reginald took great pains to devise escape routes for lovers caught with their pants down. Literally and metaphorically. He later made frequent use of them himself. Not out of fear, mind you, but to avoid having to kill his rifles in duels. Got any suspects? Considering the vast potency of Reginald's prized pouch, everyone's a suspect. Who would not want it for himself? Any idea when the theft took place? It must have been mere hours ago. I guided the last group through the exposition quite recently. Stones were very much in place. Need to look around. Might find a clue or two. Do what you must, as long as you return grasping Reginald's stones. Without them, Beauclair's entire tourist sector faces trying times. Trying times. It will all work out. 
It must. Saw marks are straight and clean. Precision castration, I'd call this. Don't worry, Reginald, don't worry. You shall be whole again soon. Dried blood stain. around. Quite the fragrant whiff. What is the pheasantry stewing up? Interrupt, I guess. This, this is not what it seems. <laughs> Word of honor. I, I, I tripped, rolled, tumbled, and landed where she already lay. Psst! Juice! That's not him! I, I swear, this is all an unfortunate coincidence. A series thereof. What? <sighs> That's not my husband. You mean... Not your husband? Who are you? And why are you in my home? Out! Now! Or I'll summon the guards! Calm down. Just here to talk. I... Uh, I believe we have nothing to talk about. Oh, we do. We do. Just to kick things off, you're in great form for a man your age. <clears throat> I eat well, start the day with a glass of wine. That preserves the body wonderfully. Interesting. Might try it. Say, ever heard of Reginald Dobry, his statue? <laughs> Everyone in the city's heard of it. Reginald's a paragon, a national hero. That's so. You seem well informed, Hughes. Maybe you know who stole Reginald's testicles. I... Uh, I can explain everything. Uh, this... Rosalinda! I know you're in there! You and that fancy pants of yours! Oh no, not him too. This really is not my day. Got you, you rogue! Prepare for a shellacking skeleton! What the love's this? Rosalinta! One I could forgive you, but two at one time! Wait, got nothing to do with this. <laughs> Take me for a fool! I'll teach you to fish in another man's pond! <sighs> got no time for this. Go home. Y yes. That'll be best. I... I'm done here. I don't know you, but that would have gone horribly for me had you not intervened. I thank you for saving my skin. Mm-hmm. So, time to talk. <sighs> Rosalinda. 
my dove. Please allow us a moment. All right. I admit I stole the stones. And you will never believe it, but they work. Today, Rosalinda and I will three times and counting. Three times? Impressive. Isn't it? At my age. That's more than the entire lost decade. All the same, you stole those stones and you gotta return them. Listen, perhaps we might strike a deal. Hmm? Let me keep the stones. I'll pay you. Grant me this, I beg you. They... They've made me young again. No chance. Need to take the stones, pure and simple. But... But if you were to leave them with me for a day or two... Three at the most. Shit out of luck. Sorry. At the day's end, it's good I had a chance to use them at all. Here, take them. Thanks. And good luck. Actually think you'll do just fine without them. We shall long bear the scars of that witch's visit. Have you recovered Reginald's family jewels? Yep, got them back. Lepiotis, luscious lips, it's them! It's really them! I hope this modest reward nonetheless conveys the extent of my gratitude. And look in on us tomorrow for the grand reopening. You shall stroke Reginald at no charge on the house. I thank you for your help. Leputa reward you with copious offspring. One 
more! And another two! You'd best behave, Fred. You're in Beauclair, see? Witcher! The Hansis! Destroy them! Welcome. Herbs freshly picked, dried, powdered. Whatsoever your heart desires. Let me see what you... Schmerb. Trample any hubs.
most gracious duchess has hired the Witcher to get to at the roots of these is murders. Resident of our fair town is hereby required to aid the Witcher in any way he requests. Open house at the Beauclair chapter of the Transnational Flagellants Club. All are invited. Ah, taste of the whip. Perhaps you'll stay longer. I imagine you've been all over the world, Sir Witcher. Come on! Come here! I shan't bite you! Huh? May I get you anything? Welcome, good sir, to Dupont and Sons' Emporium of Diverse Merchandise. Satisfaction guaranteed. Show me what you got. Instead of chatting.
find anything better in all Tucson. Lebiota, lively and spry. Ah, you can't wave their hood. Pick and choose what I the inclination. Once I close this shambles down, you won't see me till next week. Steal in all of Tusa. Take a gander. Show me what you have. Farewell. No, see you later. for a round of qu
the serendipity. I'm so glad you're back. not nearly as nasty as they make him out to be. Here in Tucson, greetings. I'm Lazar Lafargue. Geralt of Rivia. Seem pretty enthused. Got a job for me? Brother! Mind you, it's no monster hunt, but I'm sure you'll be interested all the same. I'm an armorer, see, and I for years sought diagrams for Witcher armor of exceptional quality, Grandmaster level. Heard of them. Never seen any, though. Thought they were lost. Not quite, for I've been lucky enough to learn that their holders came to Tucson. Alas, they then perished, but I know where. I just need a partner to help me retrieve them. If you know where to look, why not get them yourself? No offense, but do I look like a rough-hewn adventurer? Besides, who would serve my clients while I romped about seeking them? No. I'd rather leave it to someone familiar with such matters. Bring me the diagrams, and from them I'll forge for you whatever you fancy. What do you have on offer? These diagrams somehow wound up in Tusa. How is that even possible? Tusa was once home to Tien Sail, a legendary and now deceased elfin master armorer. Witches from all corners of the world came to him to forge their plate, their mail. Heard about him. Supposed to have been the best. And thus he charged the king's ransom for his work. Witches would take difficult, dangerous work to earn the coin to pay him. Some, alas, met with misfortune, and the diagrams they carried were left to rot with their earthly remains. Got it. Find them, find the diagrams. But how can I know where to look for their remains? As it happens, I learned my trade at Jensai's side. So I heard the stories of the missing witches first hand. What he told me, well, that is what discouraged me from seeking the diagrams out myself. We must strike a deal. I shall tell you all I know. In return, once you found the diagrams, you will let me draft a copy. This elven master. How'd he end up taking a human for an apprentice? My father forged armor. As a youngster, I helped him, then began forging my own pieces. Master Tien Sail saw my work and offered to take me on as his apprentice. Only now, years on, do I realize the honor that was. Alas, my master perished in a massacre later, slain by racists. Though he taught me everything he knew, I did not manage to complete the guild's requirements for Grand Master while he lived. I know I have no equal in the trade. Yet, uh, until I complete Witcher armor of Grand Master quality, I shall never be certain I've become my teacher's equal. Where do I look for these diagrams? I know of five likely fallen witches, each from a different school, of the wolf, griffin, cat, bear, and manticore. Which should I start with? 
Tell me about my brother, the wolf. His name was Atom. I remember him well. My master liked him, helped him find a safe yet well-paid contract. A few years ago, an archaeological expedition arrived in Tucson from Castel Gropia. They questioned my master about the elfin ruins at Termas. He warned them of the danger there and recommended they take Aton as an escort. What kind of danger did he mean? Any idea? Legend claims wraiths haunt the chambers beneath Termas. I cannot say if there is any truth to this, but both the scholars and the Witcher disappeared without a trace. The Griffin. What can you tell me about him? He came some 200 years ago, but my master remembered him well. This Witcher was not stripped of emotions, you see, as his colleagues were. He had taken on a contract at Fort Usa and required better gear. He showed my master his diagrams, paid a deposit, and was never seen again. Apparently he rode off one night from the fort, never to return. Any idea where he went? No. It said he left in a rush, so he may have left something behind. Only ruins remain of Fort Usa, but you may wish to search them. Let's talk about the cat. A year ago, Bartolome de Lorne, the ducal armorer, asked me to confirm the authenticity of a Witcher diagram he had received by messenger. You see, at the time he was working on new armor for the Ducal Guard. A Witcher from the School of the Cat offered to sell him diagrams for a full set of gear. The diagrams would have been helpful indeed. The diagram you saw, was it really a Witcher diagram? Beyond any doubt. It's a shame Delaunay didn't let me draft a copy. He was quite shaken up, afraid the Witcher might simply kill him and take his coin. Possibly a well-founded fear. Soon after, Delaunay disappeared without a trace. I would have searched his former home for clues, but it has fallen into disrepair, and it is simply too dangerous there. Tell me more about the bear, can you? He appeared shortly after Master Tien Sail took me on as his apprentice. I remember the bear head medallion that uh, hung from his neck. I remember a towering witcher who haggled like a fishwife. <laughs> Witchers never have too much coin. True, this one clearly was not wealthy. But he pledged to bring us coin after he completed a contract at the Tufo Vineyard, where a building had just collapsed. Time passed, the bear never showed, and my master sent me to the Tufo estate. As it turned out, the Witcher had indeed accepted a job. Yet that was all they heard of him, and that is all I know. School of the Manticore. Probably know the least about it, though once, long ago, wore some armor forged there. My master said the Manticores have their fortress in the Far East. A century passed, one of their number came to him, a witcher named Merton. He made a poor impression on my master. He stank like a dwarf and still, and uh, quarreled fiercely all the time. Tien Sahil slammed the door in his face and told him to return when he sobered up. He would conduct no business with a drunk. The Witcher, however, failed to return. Folk say he got into a booze-fueled brawl with the Ducal Guard. He was arrested and sentenced. Bastoy Prison, where he was held, well, it's been a ruin for years. Still, you may want to start your search there. Farewell.
Good luck on the path. Like an angry wolf. 